Love it. The Golden Flashes dream season is still alive. Good evening. I'm Danita Harris. Hey, good evening. I'm Chris Flanagan. What a game. We have live team coverage of the College World Series. Andy has the highlights. We want to get straight to Mike Karens. We're the only local TV station with a crew out in Omaha. It has been an amazing run. Cinderella still has the slipper on, and she's got a lot of dance left in her. At least that's the perception of people outside of the Kent State Circle here at the College World Series as the Golden Flashes' amazing run, their amazing season continues as they, quote, shocked the world is the way they called it tonight when they knocked off the number one team in college baseball, the Florida Gators. If you would have told us at the beginning of the season if we were going to play Florida in an elimination game in Omaha at TD Ameritrade, we probably would have laughed at you. But we're proud to be where we are, and we're just having fun and playing baseball. You know, I hope there's more in store. I mean, obviously, this kind of just shocked the world, I guess you could say. So, uh, like I said earlier, we're just trying to ride it out, see what we can do. We are just ultimately trying to go out there. Kind of had a sour taste from uh, Arkansas. People probably thought, oh, this team's Cinderella. They got lucky to get here. Don't deserve to be here. But we just want to go out there and prove to everyone that we do deserve to be here. Well, so what's up next for the most talked about team in college baseball? Well, we'll find out. They'll play the loser of this game going on behind me between South Carolina and Arkansas. I'll have much more coming up on the big win later in sports.